Hi and welcome to City Update, I'm Sherry Kropp. Well, if you're a history enthusiast or you just want to learn more about Fayetteville's history, there's a gym located in downtown Fayetteville, and that is the Fayetteville History Museum. It's full of exhibits about our local history. The museum tells a fantastic story about Fayetteville's past. As you walk through the different rooms in the museum, you'll see topical exhibits. You'll see exhibits about the Cape Fear River and the trade to and from Wilmington that helped to establish Fayetteville as the second largest city in the 1800s in all of North Carolina. You'll also find exhibits that detail uh, some of the fantastic African-American builders who helped build the foundation of our city, um, architects who helped create the buildings you still see every day, uh, we also have a fantastic exhibit on money, and you can learn all about how people of Fayetteville's past, how the money used to change hands uh, before there was a national banking system. You'll also see a wonderful exhibit on literary Fayetteville, where we have books who were written by Fayettevillians, about Fayetteville, or printed in Fayetteville. We have some fantastic rare pieces there, um, especially some first editions by our famed writer Charles Chestnut, who is a absolute gem for the city. Uh, you will also see uh, ever-changing exhibits. We are constantly adding new things. Our most current and new exhibit is an exhibit about the history of baseball in Fayetteville. And it also connects to our natural resources and discusses our city's uh, team's namesake, the Red Cockaded Woodpecker. As well, you'll find information on Fayetteville's experiences through the various wars in our country's history. Um, everything from the American Revolution on upwards. And we also have information on Fort Bragg, now Fort Liberty. Um, and so you can walk our halls and learn a little bit about Fort Liberty's origins as Fort Bragg, uh, having just celebrated 100 years a few years ago. Now, in addition to the main museum, there's an annex located right next door that houses many vintage items. At our annex, we have a plethora of different transportation information. It talks a lot about the history of Fayetteville's roads. Um, it talks about our airport and travel. We also have some wonderful pieces from our fire department, including a 1920s LaFrance engine and an 1880s Silsby. So we've got a little bit of information about how transportation changed over time, but also how transportation changed for our city services like our fire department. Now, in addition to all of the wonderful exhibits that you can find here at the museum, they also host Farmer's Market every Saturday. On any given Saturday, if you stop by the museum between 9 a.m. and 1 p.m., you'll find that on our front grounds, we have a Farmer's Market. The city market at the museum runs every Saturday, rain or shine. We have a variety of growers and crafters and artists who come out and sell their items on our grounds. Um, We've got a greengrocer and we've got someone who sells meat and we have artists and wood turners. It's a fantastic experience. The Fayetteville History Museum is open from Tuesday to Saturday from 10 to 4 p.m. and is absolutely free to anybody. We also offer tours by appointment. We would like to encourage everybody to come out and learn a little bit about Fayetteville's past and walk through our rooms and see all the amazing artifacts and information we have to share with you. Well, if you'd like to learn more about the Fayetteville History Museum and some of the exhibits that they have on display or even some of the special events that they have going on, be sure to visit the Fayetteville History Museum Facebook page. They have posts on there. You can also go to fayettevillenc.gov slash history museum. We hope you come out to the Fayetteville History Museum and we'll see you next time.